happening now. Mountain biking is a very popular outdoor activity in northwest Arkansas, and there are some things you should know before you head on the trails. Yeah, Fox 24's Enkirika Azuka is live in Bentonville this morning. And Enkirika, what can bikers do to stay safe? Well, good morning, Tobias and Caitlin. So a recent study shows that mountain bike injuries in our area have increased not only in number, but in severity as well. And this morning, I have Velvet Schultz, who is the trauma program um, manager for Northwest Health, to talk about how we can reduce these injuries. So talk about some general mountain bike safety rules. Uh, probably the biggest rule is you, gotta wear, you need to wear a helmet. The overwhelming majority of um, bike injuries are head injuries. You know, and that your helmet is your shock absorber. And so, that's probably the priority for that safety equipment. So we are ready to go with ours. What are some common misconceptions and mistakes that people make with their helmets? Um, it not fitting well is probably the most common. And um, they'd be able to have some fingers under the chin and that it sits straight on your head and then it's not too tight. You also need to appreciate that once a helmet's involved in an accident, it needs to be discarded and replaced. Do you actually have a personal history with mountain bike safety? Talk a little bit about that. I do. Um, it, my husband was killed a couple of years ago, mountain biking actually here on this trail down at the other end at Slaughter Pen. Um, he was helmeted. He did have on his safety equipment, but they were in an area that their abilities were challenged. Well, thank you so much, Velvet. So even though the Arkansas law does not require people over 21 to wear a helmet, medical professionals agree that it's the one good way that you can make sure you stay safe when you're out on the trails. We're live in Bentonville, in Kira Fox 24 News.